What's up? My name is Tech Number here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to get rid of this annoying folder that you probably have on your computer, the Creative Cloud Files. I, for one, have never used this and likely never will. How do we get rid of it? Well, if you Googled for it, you probably came across an article on the Adobe support community. Answered by an Adobe employee in 2018, this solution no longer works. And according to a lot of people in this thread, never did work. You probably landed up on this guide here telling you to download and run a file. If it doesn't work, well, hey, I guess you're screwed. Not really, hey. There's another solution that was posted on the same thread, which we'll be running through in this video here. Posted by BJM3. All you need to do in order to get rid of this is open up Registry Editor by hitting Start and type in REG and open up Registry Editor. When you get into here, all you need to do is go ahead and select the computer at the very top. Hit Control F on your keyboard to open up the Find dialog. And inside of here, type in Creative Cloud Files and such. First letter of each capitalized. Then make sure that keys and values are unselected and it's only data. Then click Find Next and wait for it to find something. When you find this over here, all you need to do is verify that it looks something like this. Sort order index and system dot is pinned. If you don't see these, hit F3 and it'll search for the next entry. It needs to look pretty much exactly like this. Anyways, what you need to do is double click on system dot is pinned and change the value from one to zero. Then click OK and close out of the Windows registry editor. Upon rebooting your computer, or at least after restarting explorer.exe, things should be updated. I'll open up Task Manager with a Windows file browser open and you'll see Windows Explorer. Right click it and click Restart. Upon it restarting, you'll be able to open up a new file browser and as you can see, the Creative Clouds folder has now vanished. Things work properly. It's super annoying. I'm not too sure why the official method doesn't work, but hey, it doesn't work. This is all you need to do in order to get rid of it. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Techno over here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.